November is such a beautiful month here in South Carolina. Great tradition for Clemson fans is beating the Gamecocks. We're going to get back to that this year. But another great tradition is National Tiger Awareness Week. Check that out. Here's the schedule for it. And now to emphasize that this is open to all Clemson fans to translate our passion for Tigers on the field and to helping Tigers in the wild, we're going to go down to Clemson Tom, the National Fan of the Year and also featured on game day. And it's going to be encouraging other Tiger schools and fans of those schools to follow Clemson's lead in this wonderful effort to save Tigers from going extinct in the wild. All right. <clears throat> As you can see, man, we're right outside Death Valley, home of the Tigers. And it's come to my attention, Tigers are almost extinct. 3,000 left in the wild, that's, that's insane. I mean, if you're with a, a horrible fan base as a bad mascot, 3,000 people probably show up to your, your games, kind of like Gamecocks. It's a chicken. I mean, you can go to KFC, Bojangles, Chick-fil-A. They're not even open on Sundays. But a tiger, you can tell it's, it's prestigious. And we got some schools on board right now, Mizzou, uh, Townsend, Princeton just jumped on board. But we need, we need more. I mean, obviously. I mean, it's, everyone has a tiger mascot. So if you have a tiger that's a mascot and it's your school, just jump on board and try to preserve your mascot. I mean, anybody can be a giant or a lion or anything else or a bulldog. Come on. Probably this thing. Anybody can be like a boxer dog. Look at this thing. Yeah. Gorgeous. So ferocious. Love it. Love it. Whoa. <laughs> but a tiger a tiger is a tiger i had the tiger rocky three was there a gamecock song don't think so was there I'm trying to think of another like random thing out there and there was no alligator looking at uf uh seminole win by john anderson that was the only thing from the seminoles uh there's no boomer sooner song there was no trojan song I mean, if you just look here, there's no Longhorn song unless you're looking at Texas Roadhouse, something like that. There's no Aggie song except for two dudes doing push-ups, staring at each other's eyes. But a tiger's a tiger for a reason. If those things go extinct, I'm going to be depressed for decades. I mean, it's a tiger. Just, just imagine waking up one day and a tiger's not there. So even if your school is not a tiger mascot, and Auburn finally step up to the plate, commit. Don't be on the fence. I know you have like a zero tolerance policy and you're looking at your players because you get from you get them from Georgia and they're always on the on the fence on certain things. Man up, don't be a war eagle, be a tiger. And we need to preserve these things. There's only 3,000 left. I mean, it's just think about 3,000 people showing up to your football game. That's how many tigers left. That should be zero to some of you people. We gotta get these things back. Let's get them. Quit poaching them. If you poach them and I find you, I'm going to give you a stone cold stunner. I'm going to give you a leg drop, the people's elbow, the undertaker, the tombstone thing. You just deserve, you're just a pitiful individual. But they're tigers for a reason. That's why so many schools have a tiger for their mascot. This is one of the greatest animals that this world can ever have. And if you can't man up, then I don't know, you just got to go somewhere else. But I'm going to do whatever I can to make sure we preserve these beautiful, beautiful creatures. And uh, if you are doing something, thumbs up. So just Auburn, get on board. Quit being 50-50. Just, goodness gracious, man up for once. That's it. Go Tigers. Every Tiger. Right now it's 4th and 16 for Tigers in the Wild, and Clemson is leading the way to help them get a first down. If we fail, it's not just game over, it's extinction. The Tiger provides Clemson with a solid mascot that represents us as a symbol of pride and strength. But currently, fewer than 3,000 remain alive in the wild. As a Clemson family, let's get all in to save our mascot from extinction.